So yo guys, we just arrived in Molsheim. We're on our way to St. Moritz. I'm out here with Bo. Look. Hi guys. And uh, we found ourselves something pretty cool. I'm gonna show you straight away. So there is a Bugatti Devo in a box right here. As you can see, it's a real Bugatti Devo with a genuine interior. It is two-tone, like on every Bugatti Devo. Has loads of carbon fiber. It's pretty cool rear lights. Right now we're in the Airbnb and we're going to St. Moritz right now. We're going to first see the cars drift on ice and then later on it's a concours d'elegance. So I'm going to try to film everything for you guys. And uh, yeah, let's leave right now. So we already found our first supercar. It's a GTC for Lusso. And there is a Roma a bit in front of it. So there it is guys, we're now arriving towards the track. So we just arrived, we got this Porsche, a Speedstar, a bunch of other stuff. Look at this Rolls Royce, it's an off-road version and it has these really special rims. This looks sick honestly. We got two Pagani Zondas, a Zonda S and a Zonda F, and some really nice specs too. These cars are the cars what made Pagani so popular actually. And they look absolutely marvelous. Wow. Here we got the second most expensive car in the world. The Pagani Zonda HP Barchetta. Limited to only three units and about 15 million euros new price. Just look at how insane this thing looks. Thing here is actually the real one from the movie. Aston Martin Beautiful Jaguar C-Type And a really nice Maserati as well So let's do the lineup real quick So here we have a really nice Ferrari that I do not know the name of We've got a Countach, a Daytona We've got an old American thing A Miura this thing. <laughs> Two generation of Maseratis, so we got the MC20 and the old MC12. Unfortunately though, the MC20 is not as limited anymore as the MC12 was, because the MC12 is one of only 20 units in the entire world. Another really special thing here is this purple Ferrari Dino. The beige interior. So now we got a bunch of old school Formula 1 cars that are passing by as you can see The Formula One thing has just ended. Meanwhile, we can take a look at some cars here. We got a 250 SWB, the 250 GTO, which is the most expensive car in the world, by the way. We got a, I think it's a Mini Cooper, but I'm not sure, Morris Coupe. I don't know what that is. Uh, we got another Ferrari, then 
another one, Maserati and a Zonda HP Bodge. Got a 275, we got a Maserati that again I do not know the name of because I'm really bad at all timers actually. And then there we got something really cool, a purple Countach, which is something I have never seen before, actually not even online, but man it looks good. So guys, I just went to the underground parking lot and we got a Huayra, a Huayra BC Roadster, a Levante and a really nice Lancia right there that gets no attention, which is a shame. Can't lie though, this might be the ugliest Pagani I've ever seen, but still, it's always cool to see one. So this is the real DB5 from the movie. Look, it's shooting guns. Ladies, all the drivers on the stage will go to the We got the Fiat that's all going again. Um, the Ferrari 250 SWB. There we have it. You can see a Maserati Levante towing a Ferrari race car, which is pretty funny. So as I said, we got a white MC20 right here next to a blue Maserati Levante, which is actually really nice. Got some blue stripes, which look a bit odd, I'm not gonna lie. Still, always cool to see one. And then another Levante in dark blue with yellow calipers. <laughs> Interesting. Now let's see what the, the cars will be right there. I don't know if I'm gonna film it or if I'm just gonna take pictures, but uh, I guess you'll find out. This is not part of the event, but there is a skyline right here, which is also something you do not see very often, especially not here. Got an old school American car. Oh, they got some pretty cool skis actually. Romeo. Ferrari 250 coming up. Ferrari GTS driving past. Mr. Ferrari 275 GTB. Didn't even see it. And there we have the C Type Jaguar C Type. So, yeah, as I said, the Jaguar C Type. So, the Miura is here. It's the 250 GTO, as you can see. Wow, this is pretty unique seeing this on the road and then the 300 SLS and the 300 going 